Holding a stick close to a spinning rotor, it's essential that every blade touches the top of the stick. Step forward even slightly, and the blade could cut it off. This isn't some extreme challenge. It's actually a test performed on helicopters called blade tracking. When a rotor spins, the blades naturally move up and down within a certain range. This is normal, but if the movement exceeds this range or becomes irregular, it can cause severe vibration, potentially leading to loss of control or even structural failure. This test checks whether the rotor blades remain in the same plane while spinning. The method is simple. A long rod wrapped in scrap paper is attached to the top of the stick. Before testing, technicians apply different colors of paint to the tip of each blade. They then slowly bring the stick close to the spinning blade so that the paint lightly touches the rod, leaving colored marks. If the marks don't overlap, it indicates that the blades are not on the same horizontal plane. Adjustments can then be made to the helicopter to improve flight safety.